We know what play we were going to at the end of the game because we work on it every single day in practice. And I wanted to be aggressive. If I could get a shot, I was going to shoot it. But um, I heard someone screaming in the back of my ear, or the back of my head, and it was Chris. And I just gave it to him and uh, let it go with confidence. I was able to, to get in this vision, and I was open. So I was screaming at him. <laughs> and uh, for, for him to be so unselfish and, uh, and give the ball, you know, it just shows what type of teammate he is, what type of person he is. <clears throat> and, you know, we, we put a lot of work in, you know, our, this team. And, you know, everybody has the confidence to, to catch and shoot. So when Arch threw me the ball, I one, two step and uh, shoot him up, sleep in the streets. <laughs> I don't think this has hit me yet. Um, it, it's, it, it's, it's amazing. It, it's amazing to be out there watching one shining moment standing up on the stage and um, seeing those kids cut down the net. I, I, don't, um, I don't really think I have the words to explain it. This is a difficult time period as a coach and the players because it's uh, you fought so hard and you did so much throughout the course of the season to have a chance to win a national championship. I've uh, had some really, really good teams and some really, really good players. And I've never been as proud as a group as I am this group right now. At that point, we believed we were going to win. We just needed 4.7 seconds of defense. Um, it didn't work out. You know, Chris is their best three-point shooter. And he got a pretty clean look um, for whatever reason. But, uh, you know, there's a 75 possessions in a game, and they just happen to get the last one and make the shot.